Hi everyone, welcome to this Twinmotion tips and tricks video. Today we'll be looking at how to create a mirror inside Twinmotion. So here I am in my bathroom. As you can see on my wall here we have a geometry that is supposed to be a mirror. So the first step will be to apply a mirror material on it. So I just opened the library on the left and we'll come to the materials folder, glass, and here we have a mirror material. Let's just drag this mirror material onto my mirror object. As you can see right now, we don't have a lot of information inside the reflection. It's because in any real-time application, what is behind the camera is not calculated. But thanks to the screen space reflection, as soon as I start to have some information, they will, this information will be reflected in my object. A trick to add more information that I will give you today is to use the Reflection Probe. You can find those Reflection Probe in the Tools Reflection Probe. So here we just drag the box reflection capture in my scene. As you can see here, we start to have a nice reflection. The Reflection Probe is um, an object that creates uh, a 360 image and it applies this image to all the reflective objects within the radius of the probe. So as you can see here, the size is set to 2 meters. I can change the size like here. And it affects all my objects. Same for my small mirror that I have here, for example. The second trick that I wanted to give you regarding the probe is that sometimes, um, let's actually open the scene organizer and enable my guy over here, Hatton. As you can see here, the first thing is that when I added the probe to the project, this person was not present. So it was not calculated, it was not rendered inside the 360 image. That means that all the new objects that I will be adding to my project won't be present in this probe. But at any moment, I can select back the probe and click on Update to calculate the probe and this guy now will be present. As you can see here, we have this kind of ghost silhouette over here. It's because of the screen space reflection again. Because this guy is present inside my viewport, you will see his reflection inside my mirror. But as soon as he disappears from my viewport, he won't be present anymore. A trick to remove this effect will be to go to the settings camera, visual effects, reflection, and here you can disable the screen space reflection to remove completely this effect. So that's how you create a mirror inside Twinmotion. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to follow us for more content and see you for the next one. Bye everyone.